Chris David Sweetie was check in on the championship game in the Sun Belt, North Texas and Arkansas State. Arkansas State running that little weave, and Ryan Weidel finishing with a three, 25-22, Arkansas State. All right, Reese, thank you very much. Here in Dayton, it's 22-19. Uh, to 19. Wright State with the lead over number 17, Butler. Another ticket to be punched tonight here in Dayton. These are the teams already in. Belmont, Winthrop, of course. Everybody's George Mason this year. Right. VCU, Penn, Niagara. Creighton. Out of a very tough Missouri Valley Conference. And on down the line. Davidson, another one. Uh, another one of those chic picks this year to do some damage in the tournament. I think VCU is one to watch as well. Anthony Grant. First year there for them has that team poised to make a run. Very strong season for VCU. Zaga with the win in the West Coast Conference Championship last night over Santa Clara. Graves hit his last one. May have heated up with that 15 footer along the baseline. This time he gets a three. Well, scores aren't going to stay down for long. And when you heard that stat of him in the last three games here coming in struggling. At some point, he's going to break out of that. And he got that one off the bounce to go, and then that three looked really good. Off the hands of Climate, here comes Gray. He'll thing, set it up. The thing I love about Butler, they don't turn the ball over. Best in the country at that. Only a little bit more than nine turnovers a game, and they don't take bad shots. So no rust, hurry shots, few turnovers. That's what makes them so difficult to beat. Now, if you're in single digits, you figure that's a good game. They average single digits for the year. Striker, a little bit strong with the three. And here come the Raiders. Drew Striker had a good look at that three right there. Shoots 44% on the year, so it's a good look for him. Duggins threw it right to the scorer's table. And Butler will take over you think back to the early season run by Butler and it just makes makes you shake your head who they beat in the NIT Notre Dame Indiana Tennessee, Gonzaga all the way through to the championship and you talk to their people they say you know what we were even shocked at that point because they were picked to finish sixth, sixth. <laughs> in the yes. Horizon League this year right so you and then you've got a, a transfer guard in Mike Green coming in from Towson you don't know how he's going to blend with A.J. Gray. So early in the season, they just put it together quickly, and their toughness and half-court execution prevail. Tough shot for Campbell underneath. And here comes Wood. Bounce pass taken away. Can't call the timeout in the air anymore, and <laughs> they don't get it. So uh, it'll be Wright State basketball. And Brandon Crone thought about it there for a second. He said, oh, what the heck. I'll just go out of bounds. Really. But good hustle defensively. Might as well try, right? Hey, man, why not? Brian Ligon, the senior from St. Petersburg, Florida, comes in, a guy who missed most of two years with season-ending knee injuries, two different knees his first two years at Butler. He only played 12 games his first couple of seasons. Lord, the runner. Pretty. Showing you a lot of stuff here in the first half. When you can split defenders, Going full speed and hop off one foot going towards the basket with no glass. That's 9.9 .9 degree of difficulty on that shot. 15 in the game already for Deshaun Wood. Great match up here with Graves. Home oh, off balance fadeaway, not his shot. And Scotty Wilson active so far. So the right state defense has been impressive. After spotting Butler 10 points to start the game, they've really settled in and taken away the Bulldogs' first option. Wilson got tied up, almost had it taken away. And here's Graham out to Wood, approaching 10 on the shot clock. Deshaun with the crossover to Burleson. Under five, got to get it up on the glass here. Duggins. Good defense from Butler. Yeah, that's pretty good playmaking that time. Deshaun Woods, shot clock running down, didn't have a whole lot to do, but got his teammate an open look. Green, the nice dish underneath. Pretty to Willard Beasley. Beasley. 
And we're tied at 24. You get the sense that this is going to be a good one to the end. Yeah, these, these two teams know each other. This time of year, they haven't. There's nothing new in the playbook that they haven't scouted or seen. So now it's just player reads and guys like this stepping up. Wow. Another three ball, and he's got 18 in the game already. Deshaun Wood, remember he had 30 in the second matchup with Butler. You think A.J. Graves doesn't get every guard's best shot that he goes up against in this conference? Deshaun Wood is saving his best for tonight. They're on their feet inside the Irvin J. Nutter Center. Throne, good kick out to Green who spotted up. Nope, not this time. And he'll hear about it. One NCAA tournament for Wright State. That was back in 1993. They won the Division II national title back in 83. Well, and their, their success in the shadow of Dayton out of the A-10 has been really impressive. Hurls it from Wood. Well, he took a page right out of Butler's book. Run the shot clock down. Crisp set screens. And guys coming off looking to shoot. And Deshaun Wood has shared the rock, Terry, despite having the hot hand. Drew Bolson that time, he wants to be a doctor. His dad's a dentist, he's a senior. Offensive foul on Butler. Six point lead by Wright State. Wood doing a little bit of everything for Wright State, the top seed on top.